How do you get the best out of a mortgage broker? How do you get the lending that you require? Let's say you are going in and you're going into a new mortgage broker. How do you build that credibility? How do you pedestalize your position above all the other investors out there in a heated competitive market? The mortgage broker pack is the key. What mistake that many people make out there is that they will go into a mortgage broker and they will provide information to them in little pieces. They don't give them the information all at once, so the mortgage broker gets frustrated, they're always asking for information, and what that ends up doing is you end up losing your deal, and at the same time, the mortgage broker doesn't want to deal with you either. So how do you alleviate all of this? How do you get that mortgage broker to work for you? How do you make sure that you get the deal? The mortgage broker pack is the key. So what is the mortgage broker pack? Let's discuss this right now. Now you can do this online, and you can do this offline. I would suggest that you do both. So you create, a online file. In the online file, you have a contents page. And in that contents page, what you do is you put in these key aspects. So first of all, you put in your current portfolio, your current residential address. You put in your personal simple details, whether you're employed or whether you're self-employed. If you're self-employed, please make sure that you've got your SA302s, what they're known as now, your tax computations, and that you can get from HMRC because that, trust me, will take your time to get. So you get all of this ready right at the front. Anything adverse, many people what they do is they hide that from the mortgage brokers. If there's anything adverse, always put it right at the front because remember, a good mortgage broker is on your side. They wanna get you that mortgage. They wanna get you that lending. Now we've got so much more to cover. Now, if you haven't subscribed to our channel, now's the time to subscribe. You can do this right now. Also click on that bell icon to get the latest notifications and I love to hear your comments. So do like this video and comment on this video as well. Let's carry on. You now decide to create a offline folder, a physical folder. So you spend 20 pounds as a maximum budget and you find the folder that says something about you. Choose something that you feel really comfortable with and it, it resonates with you. In that folder, you create that same physical contents page and you create tabs and you put all the information in there. Also, you add in there your pay slips if you're employed, your salary, your last three months to your last six months. You add that in there as well. Your current portfolio, if you have one, you add that in there as well. So you're adding all these parts in and you're creating nice, lovely tabs and you have a content page and right at the front, put your name in there. And trust me, you take this physical folder and you present it to the mortgage broker. Trust me, many people don't do this. Now, you hand this mortgage broker pack to the mortgage broker, watch their face. You are the client from heaven. And your position has gone from wherever it was right the way up here. And that mortgage broker, he or she is going to want to deal with you because you have made their life easier. Secondly, you provided all the information that you need all in one place. It's nice and succinct and you're gonna get the deal done.